Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about Grindr and more specifically, I'm going to talk about the Grindr Sugar Daddy scam. So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, this is going to be a really quick video, not a lot of information to talk about, but it will save you a lot of money. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video. So I've already opened up the Grindr webpage right here. If you don't have this app already, check my video description. I'll try to leave a quick link there. But what is the Grindr Sugar Daddy scam? That's what we're talking about. And basically what it is, is if you're on Grindr, you might be looking for a date. And a lot of times what's happening these days, a lot of viewers have told me that they get requests from usually older men asking for a sugar baby. Well, what does that mean? Well, if you're not familiar with a sugar baby, basically what it is, is it's usually an older person with a lot of money who pays usually younger men to send pictures each week or to provide phone calls companionship or maybe even in-person companionship and in exchange the wealthy individual pays that person a weekly allowance or sometimes a monthly allowance and this scam happens a lot on Grindr. Now if you are approached by one of these men on Grindr and asks for you to be their sugar baby, usually they're going to ask you for two different things. They're going to ask you for your email address and they're also going to say that they're going to pay you through Venmo or Cash App. So they need your cash tag name or your Venmo ID. And if you're unfortunate enough to provide this person with that information, you're going to get an email almost immediately from either Venmo or Cash App. Or actually it looks like it's Venmo or Cash App, but most of the time it's just the scammer. However, these emails look really authentic and it's hard to discern if it's an authentic email or if it's actually from Venmo or Cash App. The most common dollar amount that I see on these emails recently is $3,000. And the sugar daddy is going to pay this young man usually $3,000 supposedly per week. But in the email, it's going to say that you have $3,000 available in your Cash App or Venmo. But in order to release it, they need to receive what's called a clearance fee. The most common dollar amount for this clearance fee that I've seen recently is going to be $50 or $100. So again, what the email says is in order to access the $3,000 as a sugar baby, that you need to pay Venmo or Cash App $50 or $100 to the cash tag that's listed or the Venmo ID. This is where the scam happens. So a lot of unsuspecting young men go ahead and send that money to that cash tag or Venmo, hoping to get the $3,000. And what happens then that money, it goes directly to an account that that so-called sugar daddy had. Once they receive the $50 or $100, then they immediately block you. So at that point, you're going to be a sugar baby, less $50 or $100. And be careful guys, because with Venmo and Cash App, it's an instant payment, so it's almost impossible to receive that money back or to get a refund. So to help protect yourself from the Grinder Sugar Daddy scam, what you want to do is on any kind of email that looks suspicious or from any so-called sugar daddies, you want to go ahead and click on the top address bar and see where this email came from. Most of the time it's going to say something like cash support or Venmo support, but if you click on that, it should reveal the email address that that actually came from. And the email address is usually going to be something like cashappsupport at gmail.com or yahoo.com or maybe Venmo support at hotmail.com or msn.com. And it's obvious that Venmo and Cash App will not email you from a Gmail account or anything outside of their internal email address. So that is a grinder sugar daddy scam. So what about you? If you're a sugar baby and you fell victim to another sugar daddy scam on Grindr, and you want the rest of us to know, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know to help protect ourselves from losing our money. But hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel. And I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.